can't seem to understand. I'm not locked in here with you. You're locked in here with me! Hello guys, this is Rock here and today I will be talking about the Banshee again and Banshee 3S again. If you remember, I had a build called the Ripper. Um, I think I made videos about it in the last year, but that build had ballistics as well. So this time I decided to do only lasers and only pulse lasers and the results are really, really good. I am surprised how much this mech keeps giving. It's, it's an all-around amazing mech and really I can't wait to show the footage I got to you. So let me show you the build really quick. So we have the Maximum engine. Uh, it's a 345 light and I got three large pulses and four medium pulses along with the, all the <laughs> heat sinks that I could cram in which is 22, it's a very respectable number. I think you can't put more than 22 um, with weapons in any other uh, laser IS mech. So it's very respectable, uh, the amount of cooling you get, and you get more cooling because it has a minus 10% heat generation quirk. So combined with this much heat sinks and minus 10% heat gen and on top of it, the amount you get from the quirks, you have a very, very heat efficient laser platform. And you also get extra armor compared to other Banshees. So this one gets the plus 25 CT armor and plus 16 side torso armor, along with um, arm armors, plus 16 again. Sorry, plus 10 again. And if you combine everything, this make becomes a beast. I think um, when they stopped working on this game, <laughs> they left some mechs unbalanced. Some of them are really terrible right now, in a very bad situation. I'm talking about mechs like Jenner. But they also left some of the mechs in a slightly overpowered state, like this one. Now, I know why they gave this one better quirks, because this one has a, a lower engine cap, 345 only. And the others always had a um, larger engine cap, so Excel, you could put XL 400s, and they also had um, heat, heat quirks, so they gave more armor and nice quirks to this one to compensate. But when they released the skill tree and they desynced the engines from all those bonus movements and mobility bonuses, um, the engine, the higher engine cap kind of lost its appeal for uh, the other one, so having a bigger engine didn't really translate into, uh, you know, uh, bigger benefits for the other Banshees. Well, you could still have the speed, but you didn't have the mobility, so XL400 or XL or, or a light engine 345, they feel the same mobility-wise. But this one benefited from it because, you know, uh, engine size doesn't really matter anymore and uh, plus it got to keep its quirks so uh, it's really really strong right now and I'm, I'm, I'm just gonna show it to you in the uh, upcoming footage Nine. so let's move on to the gameplay now All this thing normal. is what I would call a laser bro you know rolling with lasers isn't hostile. really a thing um, in other mechs because lasers are inherently hot and they are not meant to be you know sustained fire weapons you dump your lasers you cool off you do it again you cool off and do, you do it again but in this mech we have so much cooling capacity that we can just keep dumping those alphas and we can get away with it and if you wait a few seconds we can alpha again Target acquired. so so right in the beginning I'm using this very aggressive, I'm gonna park it in a very aggressive position. I'm gonna cut off their advance 
to the middle and to our flank. So I find a nice cover. I find a nice cover here, and the mad cat is pushing. I work on components. I work on a single component, and I just keep disarming the enemy. Mechs. This is what this mech is good at. You steady your aim. You aim carefully, and two alphas you rip that component apart, and the enemies basically help us against you. In the meanwhile, you got so much armor that you can take take shots and because Banshee is a very tanky mech, I mean if you twist in it, the arms the arms absorb a ridiculous amount of damage. So this this guy's uh, disarmed and he's over extended so I just front him and he's a bit of a And I'm looking at the map. Looks like they will be acquired. Um, they are indecisive. Looks like they wanna keep their ground, so I move back to my old position. We got some nice opportunities here, and of course we snatch a kill on the way. Uh, what makes this build so deadly is it's a purely pulse build, so the damage you do is applied in so, so little time that most of the damage goes to a single component, so you can't really spread your damage if you if you were aiming steady in the beginning. So um, once you alpha, you get that component. If you keep alpha in, you kill it. Basically, uh, this mech, you keep it cool, you aim steady and nothing can stand in its way. I don't think many mechs can uh, out DPS this. Even can even win against um, ballistic bolts like the uh, Mad Cat. Because you have so much armor, you can take the punishment while well, they can't. As I said, I'm keeping it cool, but I also adjust my position so that I always have the line of sight to an enemy. Uh, lights and mediums are especially very easy to get rid of because a single alpha is 54 damage and. With a single alpha, you can kill most of them. If they were hurt in two alphas in a steady, uh, with steady, they will just die right away. This guy is tanking it for some reason. I don't understand why he didn't die. Get a linebacker flanking on right. Gotta be careful. Also, you should keep override engaged most of the time, unless you think you're gonna die from overheating, uh, because momentarily you will. Uh, exit 100%. So, and you don't want to shut down in those situations where you are, you know, highly stressed by any max. You want to keep shooting. You can take the overheat damage uh, unless you know you don't exaggerate it. It's an assault after all. It has a lot of components. internal health. Vapor Eagle tries to run away, but no. this build is just just a beast. And we keep getting rid of him. This guy is also very weak. Target destroyed. New target acquired. It's 9 to 6, and yeah, the game will most probably end in our favor. New target acquired. Poor kitty. Doesn't stand a chance. And we're chasing the linebacker. As you can see, this make makes it look so easy. You just keep dumping your alphas. And they just keep dying, and it doesn't feel like you're doing much damage. Target destroyed. There he goes, he kills himself. We have one more mech remaining. Have already started to make a dent. Be but sure to in, stop it them. was only 5 minutes of gameplay. And there he is standing there again. I don't know why he's doing this. But he's dead anyway. Anyway. <laughs> so, 5 minutes straight. Including, you know, all the all the downtime in the beginning, and well, we did <laughs> 1,450 damage and six killing blows, four solo kills, seven kill most damage dealt. As I said, this mech makes it look easy, uh, but it's such a beast. So I got three more matches to show you to further demonstrate the consistency of this build. It's very hard to have a bad match in this. Even in those matches where your team is folding, you can really pull off some amazing moves. So even a loss feels like a victory sometimes. 
but don't forget you can alpha three times without shutting down so that's uh, 100 almost 160 damage before you sh you're shut down and it's delivered in like uh, 10 seconds 12 seconds and don't tr forget to twist rigorously between alphas and you will live a long time and yeah i hope you guys enjoy this build enjoy this gameplay because i sure as hell <laughs> enjoyed making it so i'll see you guys in the next videos and these videos have a commentary of their own they were made during my stream so you will still hear me see you guys nobody's shooting up, of course Yeah, it looks like we're not taking high ground. Wait up, NASCAR. Target acquired. Do you want to go up? Start peeking and poking. They have the high ground and we're on the low ground. New target acquired. But I guess they are not expecting us here. They're happily learning the guys in E6. Oh wait, I got locked. Let's see. He jumped down though. New Come on already, acquired. I wanna see a mech. Don't block me guys. Don't block me. Let me do my damage, please. Please! New target acquired. Critical. Artillery. New target acquired. New target acquired. Eight level critical. Fuck! Can't take two. Hey, come zero. Which is dead, probably. Come on, kill him already. Do it again. Do it again. Damn it. Damn, that hurt. Some beefy laser boots here. Damn it, I should stop doing this. I can't take another RT. No, 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 no. I need to jump down. My back is scored. Make them jump down, dude. I can kill them totally.
because I could have killed all of them. <laughs> if my back wasn't so weak and I could move. <laughs> Damn it. Five kills, one ticket, one K damage. Should have overridden, damn it. Ah. Coulda, woulda, shoulda. It's a good build, it's a fun mech. Can we make it even better? But that is the question. Which makes this thing a laser god. Reactor online. Sensors online. Weapons online. All systems nominal. Command coming in. Yeah, regular bits. I'm trying to keep up. I'm down to one video per week. <laughs> uh, but yeah, it's it's because of work. Work picked up again and I couldn't upload it or get footage. But I won't stop, at least there will be at least one video. One nice video. <laughs> per week. Enemy forces have Sigma. They've taken Epsilon. Command confirming that we have possession of Kappa. This is a bit slower than I would like, but. Leons. Target acquired. We have Gamma. Oh yeah, oh no, they they actually went left or heavy lamps is on the far left. Which means we're gonna get wrecked here. What are these guys doing? They came from the wrong way. They were supposed to go left. As well. Guys, make room for assaults. Nice. I'll help you. Stop dying. Artillery strike online. New target acquired. Warning incoming missile. Oh no, not the lerms. New target acquired. Critical. Resource point beta is ours. Heat level critical. Damage output is just ridiculous. Block me. I'm just with you. Let's not kill ourselves. Okay, time to cool down. They're coming back. Somehow. Target acquired. They made a comeback. Target destroyed. New the target acquired. Quick draws any good? I think the hero is good. The rest, I can't. I don't know. I haven't played that much after the. They the changed the quirks. Uh, sorry, they introduced skill tree. 
Let's get target that. destroyed. New target acquired. Ooh, right out there. Up here. Halfway to victory. We need to keep holding on to our resource point. I got it, guys. I got it. I got it. I guess I'll just wait. Oh, there it is. Where'd it go? Target acquired. Up there. Target destroyed. We've gathered enough resources. <laughs> this triumph will provide us huge tactical benefits. I don't know if it's 1k, probably not. Oh, almost 1k. Five kills. See? That looked like it like nowhere near 1k but <laughs> damage output is actually insane on this and we carry it together with Leon Whatever, I'm not going up. Artillery strike online. Heat level. Okay, we can alpha three times without shutting down. That's very decent. Mm -hmm. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm gonna take over. <laughs> He's also lost. Like, where are we going? Target acquired. Target spotted. Somebody died. Nice. <laughs> Priyana killed someone. <laughs> uh, classic. Spotted. New target acquired. I hope it was an uh, assault. New target acquired. Fuck it, we're going in, guys. It's happening. I just need to get in range for all large pulses. I'm probably spotted, yes. New target acquired. What are you gonna do learn me? Target acquired. Artillery strike. Nice, good RT.
target acquired. Nice, 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 nice. Work door uh, overheat. Now let's go in and kill them. Where's this ultra AC guy? Jesus Christ. Target acquired. Target destroyed. New target acquired. Heat level critical. Target destroyed. New target acquired. <laughs> this thing is a beast. A loot. Kills five kills again. Target Command destroyed. We're detecting no more hostiles. Good job, soldiers. What I don't like is what I uh, sorry don't get is how did that Mauler kill that Nanook? I could hear his ultra ACs, but Nanook just ignored him while I was trying to find him. Interesting. Another good match.